And today's product will be something that you have been seeing a lot on social media, online and whatnot. One time. So as usual, what I did is I went into the ingredients and I tried to find out whether there's anything wrong with this product. But for this product, I would definitely... I will give it to it lah, okay? So... Hi and welcome back to Beauty Without Filter. I am Atika Ho, your makeup artist in Singapore. And today I'll be doing a wholesale liao review series again and it will be on this bubble mask. And I keep seeing like all these bubble masks popping up on Instagram. And Janice actually approached me and asked me if I want to review her Allure bubble mask. And I was like, why not right? So anyway, stay tuned till the end of this review video because there will be a giveaway. This is my first, very first giveaway for Beauty Without Filter and Janice is so kind to be part of it as well. So let me get down to the review because if it's not good then you won't even want this giveaway, right? So, so what is this mask for? It is actually to deep cleanse and also to brighten your complexion. And how it really works is that there's this ingredient in most bubble masks. It actually extracts the oxygen in the air and retain it in your mask while you're doing it. And so this oxygen is supposed to like penetrate into your skin. The oxygen is good for aging and builds like collagen etc etc. There's so much benefits about oxygen. After washing my face and cleansing my face, I put on this uh, bubble mask for 10 to 15 minutes and instantly uh, I already can see like little bubbles foaming up on this mask and I have been using bubble mask. I love bubble mask actually because I feel that like it always makes your skin so 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 radiant and okay my honest opinion about this bubble mask so I think that you have already seen like a lot of before and after photos out there and like for me I'm like really I mean it looks pretty like not believable la, I feel but for this product I would definitely I will give it to it lah okay so I'm just gonna cut this short and not beat around the bush and I will just let you know that this mask definitely definitely make my face so much brighter and okay I'm, I've been using retinol recently and uh, this retinol that I'm using is pretty strong so I have like really dry patches especially around my cheeks area and after I apply this mask my skin was soft okay and it is instantly bright like can you tell how bright my skin is after using this bubble mask so after I use it for like 10-15 minutes I went to rinse my face like, with water so as usual, what I did is I went into the ingredients and I tried to find out whether there's anything wrong with this product. And this product is actually formulated in Singapore. Hmm. And they also say that it is okay or it is uh, suitable for sensitive skin. So anyway, I went to research on the ingredient list and I would say that I am pretty impressed with this product. So I'll leave that detailed chart of ingredients over here for those of you who are really interested and I will just briefly highlight the main ingredients that I think that I should highlight so the second ingredient on this Allure mask is uh, Butanidol so Butanidol is somewhat similar to Butan Glycol which I did state in my Ota video that I'm not really a very uh, I'm not a big fan of it because it is derived from like petroleum lah. so uh, but I did also realize that a lot of big brands are using this ingredient and well I have nothing to say about it uh, because a lot of them state that it is actually safe to use and it's not toxic as well it's like it's not it doesn't cause any irritation to your skin blah 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 so apparently this botanic doll is also uh, good for your skin so it's in fact it actually improve your skin condition then there's also this um, pack 17 slash 6 there's some people that say like you shouldn't use products that contains pack because it is definitely uh, one of the no-go ingredients uh, but in fact um, for this particular pack uh, so stated by Polar's Choice um, blog or beauty blog. I love Polar's Choice beauty blog by the way. <laughs> so anyway, their rating is that this uh, particular ingredient is actually good. But I did find out like in another website that uh, they do not recommend to use it on like broken or damaged skin uh, because it might cause irritation. Okay, so then okay, there's this C12-7 
16. And then I'm um, like, okay, what is that, right? Like, is it part of like another ingredient? But I realized, no, they were quite smart to eliminate the alcohol in it. So C1260 is actually an alcohol. Also, according to Paula's choice, uh, they did say that this C1216 is good and it is actually considered safe and non-sensitive for skin. So in fact, uh, like people with sensitive skin can also use it. And I will say that I did not find any fault in this particular item and I am very glad to say that I approve of this bubble mask. I will definitely use it again and I definitely think that it's one of the better bubble masks out there in the market. So yep, I hope that you enjoyed my Jose Liao review video again. So if you want to get your hands on this like bubble mask, you can go and check out Jenny's IG. This is a handle and I also put it in the description box. Oh yeah, and also if you quote uh, Beauty Without Filter, you will get free career. So remember to do that. And also, here comes the exciting part which is the giveaway! Okay, oh my god, I'm so excited. This is like my first time doing a giveaway. And... So I'm going to give away this one box of a Leo mask as well as this really cute like headband that Jenny's gave. So all you need to do is to like my post, follow me and follow Jenny's and also drop me a comment and tag one of your friends so that I can choose one lucky winner. And I will choose a lucky winner next week and I will definitely notify you through your uh, direct messages. So do check your message. Bye!